We begin with breaking news. Right now, a man is dead and two Maryland State Police troopers just released from the hospital after a shooting during a barricade in Allegheny County. It happened a little after 9 a.m. in the town of Little Orleans. Investigators say it started last night with an argument between a man and a woman. 52-year-old William McKenzie was shot and killed at the scene. WJZ is live. Mike Halgren is live at Shock Trauma, where those two state troopers were just released. Mike. Lynn, that's the good news. They had been treated here after being airlifted earlier. We can also tell you the identity of the suspect. He's 66 years old. William Chaz Charles McKenzie is his name. Here's more on what led police to the scene and what happened earlier this morning. These are pictures from the scene in Allegheny County where a man shot two Maryland state troopers this morning. It began last night as a domestic dispute. The suspect was fighting with his wife. He threatened her with a gun. It fired as they struggled on the ground. She ran to a neighbor's house to call police. Troopers from the Cumberland Barrack responded. The man barricaded himself inside his home. State police say he refused to come out. He shot the troopers as a SWAT team entered his home. He also set that home on fire. Police shot the suspect who died at a hospital in Washington County. Now we just heard from state police spokeswoman Elena Russo. Unfortunately, we don't have that sound to share with you, but I can tell you she told us that uh, they know of at least one weapon this suspect had. There were also a number of animals in that home as well that they were trying to rescue, and Maryland State Police remain on scene as they try to complete this investigation. Live at Shock Trauma, Mike Helgren, WJZ. Mike, thank you. We'll have more information on WJZ at 4, 5, and 6.